Welcome to Tiger Tales Gaming. My name is Xavier Wolf. And I'm TK. And we are playing Tanglewood. On the Sega Mega Drive. Well, we were until the death of the main character. And now we're just going to go play a better game. Bye. <sighs> yeah, if you've not been keeping up, uh, then yeah, make a point just there. Um, but yes, go back and watch episode one, and then two, and then three, and then Thank four, and five, devs. and come on to level six. Thank you, devs. Yeah, he's not at all emotionally distraught by this in the slightest. I wouldn't have minded. I wouldn't have minded if it wasn't for the fact we're now playing as the other character. You would have minded. You would have minded a lot. <laughs> so yeah, so this is chapter six yep. of Tanglewood, and we are now playing as the character we... I would say rescued, more of a case of they ran past us, left us to dealing with shit, whereupon they then adopted us, and... And have yeah. been a loyal companion ever since. Ow! So yeah, we're yes. going to be playing Chapter 6. If you haven't yet bought yourself a copy of Tanglewood, it's available on Steam at the moment. Yep. Go to the links in the description, as uh, have been every episode so far. And if you've missed it from the previous episodes, I've not played this before. TK and Hedgy have. Yep. So this is my first time. This is why I'm doing the, the official kind of run yep. through. In fact, everyone here at Tiger Tales Gaming, <laughs> except for Xavier, was part of the closed beta. So beta. Beta. We're English. <laughs> yeah. We'll keep on having this argument every episode if we need to. Well, we will. <laughs> <laughs> so let's get down and play yes. Chapter 6. And so level 6 begins. And all with nip ready. Shadow. Silhouette. Shadows. As the one of the twin suns goes down and one of the twin moons rises. That looks weird. It's quite cool, isn't it? Yeah. Like I, say, I love it when games do this and just kind of mix up their visual styles. Well, it does give you... Although, coming back round to it is a bit odd. It does give you a bit of... perspective of the, fa of the fact it is a weird-ass world. Yes, it is very weird. So, we are playing the escort minion. We're playing as Echo. Having, get off, get off. <laughs> having created the, uh, or having found the the Scrappy Doo. It was a little baby Jack. Oh, is that, why is there another one here? Because there was a bridge. And maybe you've got to leave it on the bridge so that it falls later, perhaps. Tick, 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 maybe. Tick. I also notice a lot of thorns. I think the ones in the ceiling are safe. It's any that are on the ground or on the sides that'll, uh, that'll hurt you. You're right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like, test that early. <laughs> test that early. <laughs> right. Because I, I, I've seen things like Shovel Knight. Not Shovel Knight. Hollow Knight. Yeah. Holy fuck. As much as I would love to play that game, my God, that's on levels of difficulty that I'm not entirely sure I want to even start with. Trouble is there's other stuff like Dead Cells, because this is a thing, this is kind of where a lot of these games are inspired off of, the action platformer puzzler. Well things like Flashback The Lion King, oh, God, Abe's yeah. Odyssey and Exodus. Uh, some say there's been a hint of Limbo in here Oh uh, yeah. So uh, nods to The Lion King and elements of Sonic the Hedgehog obviously because you can't have a platform game without some nod to Sonic the Hedgehog <laughs> uh, at least on the Mega Drive anyway if you're on a Nintendo console, then obviously you've got to have a not to Mario. Yeah. Ah! Jump in. Never mind. Wrong button. No, no, you did want to jump, just not that far. <laughs> I wanted to push it in first. That's you could have rolled it in. I could have rolled it in. Right, so let us run. Uh, so yeah, the the music is quite light. It's atmospheric. Yeah. It's composed by a gentleman named Freestream, mm. who did a fantastic work on the score, I think. Especially with the sound engine that they're using, uh, which was programmed by someone called Sick, which is their, obviously their nickname. Yeah. Uh, but it's actually called the Echo Sound Engine, uh. and was just a, an amusing coincidence. <laughs> But it is really, it is, it's different to not have as much noise and music and background stuff going on. Oh, did you never play Another World? I played Another World, I'm just thought it was on a track. No. No, it's just been a while. Sound effects until the action kicked in, then you got a bit of a soundtrack for a while. Is 
he going to go for the Firefly? Yes, he is. Well, now I know the ceiling thorns don't kill me. Yes, unless I will. You, unless you're in a gliding section. I think they might kill you in a gliding section. Oh, great. Just, you know, add that bit of challenge. Cause ceiling? Yeah. Not that I could tell if I'm gliding at this point, because I'm Shadow! No, that was a very terrible character from the Sonic the Hedgehog series. <laughs> Hedgy liked him. Yeah, I know. That's why I say it now. Because <laughs> Hedgy's not around. <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, I managed to complete... Sonic Adventure 1. Sonic Adventure 1, no, but... Um, I don't, don't think it was Gentle Flashback jump. or... I think it was either Flashback or <clears throat> Another World. No, Another World was the harder one. Flashback I managed to complete once. I've seen the... Well, I've got to the ending in Another World, but I've never completed Another World. Because I managed to, uh, well, basically just pressing buttons in the level select area, I managed to work out the code for the final level. <laughs> and so I managed to do that fight, which was really hard on the Mega Drive, because during the shooting section, uh, where it's all action and fast and heavy, the Mega Drive slows down to a crawl. Yeah. And that section suddenly becomes very tough. Oh, God, yeah. But I managed to do it in the end, and got my way and saw the ending. But I've never actually completed the game. Not f not properly. Yeah, another but world in the flashback of those... Your head. Jesus! And squished you. Fuckity fuck. That's a, that's a cutscene as well without dropping, unless I can... Yeah, I wouldn't hang around if I were you. Oh, it is actually, yeah. Yes. I should be able to find a place where I can get out of the way of that. Hang on, I think I might have a way of yeah, getting out of the way of that. Yeah, just run faster. Can I jump? Is that... No, that's too high. I couldn't... Trying to find a way of breaking... Shite! Trying to find a way of breaking shite. Wow. Oh, and how did the boulder get like this? That was a jump for me, but that was fine for the boulder. Boulder's faster than you are. <laughs> Momentum. Bullshit chicanery. Piss off! <laughs> that was not a fun experience. Yeah, it was. I've avoided the boulder. There's a monster. Fuck! There's a boulder. Now you're safe. Ay, ay, ay. Now you can go along the spiky bits. Yes, these ones, which we've just dropped a monster in. Because, fuck monsters. Yeah, tread carefully, folks. <laughs> there we go. But yeah, managed manage to complete Flashback once. My god, that's a game that you need to think as you go into the encounters. The final boss fight on that is... Tricky. You've got all the fireflies! Yeah. No! That's not fun! <laughs> yeah! That's not fun! <laughs> I wish I was filming your face then. <laughs> For those of you who can't see his face, i.e. everyone except me, it's a mix of wide-eyed amazement as like, how the hell am I supposed to do this? <laughs> With a a smug grin as if to say oh no no he's done it never mind oh what so at least you know where you're going wrong each time yes and it, it's this building up of experience that then prepares you for the the long game that's it Now you can just jump down there and completely avoid him. He's not coming. No. <laughs> he does. <laughs> this is why I was planning on killing them all by luring them onto spike traps. Christ. <laughs> Back we come. At least you're going to get good at this section. Yeah, I'll be very good at this section by the end.
You'll learn all the speedrunning strats for it. I, I would not want to speedrun this. This is not what I would call fun. Stay up. Squish. Because random boulders happen. Yeah, we don't actually think you need the boulder, but for you it's useful having it down there. <laughs> Until the monsters come, in which case, yay! Oh, the backgrounds are pretty. Yeah, considering the Mega Drive's got a very limited colour palette for this kind of thing, mm. they, you know, they've actually taken as much use of it as they can. It's very easy to forget that this is actually running on a physical Mega Drive, because so used to ROMs and stuff. Yeah. Jump! And jump over there again! Or just fall! Jumping button! <laughs> I press the button, it doesn't jump. Must remember, this is a Sega game. A uh, Sega no, Mega it's Drive not, game. it's a Mega Drive it's game. It's a Mega Drive game. It is very much Sega. not a Sega game. It is in no way affiliated with Sega Enterprises in any way, <laughs> shape, or form. <laughs> right, there's those guys done. Dread to think what a hundred percent speed run on this is really like. Cause some of those fireflies. <laughs> well, apparently, it's, I think it's uh, a Russian uh, has done it in, in just over two hours. Ooh. So I'm going to watch that stream at some point and learn. Two hours. <coughs> there has to be some glitches. There has to be some shortcuts. Oh no doubt. I mean, for all the beta testing that we did, uh, no game is ever perfect and completely free from bugs. Yeah. Because Sonic. I mean, what I really liked <laughs> about the beta process was that there was a nice mix of abilities in there. And so we had people who play games a lot and are very, very good at games, and people who had a lot of technical knowledge about games and things. And then we had people like me, who was the more... I'm a player. I'm not great at any games, I'm, but I'm, I'm a good ordinary pleb. And it's from the ordinary pleb perspective. They're all stood on top of each other. Yeah. Fine, fuck you guys. Have fun. But the music's still going. Fuck! Have fun. I wonder how close to a checkpoint you were. <laughs> Probably very. <laughs> it's going to be much editing of this one. Stopped. A checkpoint! He's done it! <sighs> and there's a fuzzle! Great, it's a black fuzzle. No, it's not a black fuzzle, it's a silhouetted fuzzle. <laughs> You'll know what power it gives you. If this turns into blue, I'll be so pissed off. <laughs> blue! Now you're yellow. There we go, right. 
That's another fossil, that's the stop rolling it thing. But you're probably going to want to glide up there. There you go, you've got fireflies. Yeah, it does apply. <laughs> that was all spiky bits of death. <laughs> yeah, he's done it! Yay! God. They won't see how many times that took in the edits. <sighs> That can be edited. <laughs> that will be edited. Jesus! That won't. <laughs> <sighs> After all of that. You got there in the end? Yes, I got there in the end. That was a, that was a long fight. Are they...? No. So, how do... Leap of faith. Leap of faith and die. Because so, being able to see where you're landing... It's a platformer. There's always the occasional leap of faith. <laughs> Just be glad this is the first kind of major one. Yeah. Otherwise I would have thrown the entire controller across the room. Getting close. Just takes a little practice. <sighs> Like, there'll be a platform there, there'll be a pixel there, there that's, that's what that is. There you go. This, this level is just look before you leap. No, 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 this is not funny. Thank you. Yeah, I hadn't quite passed the trigger. Oh. Fuck you! <laughs> yeah, you you love that wall. By the way, there's another one up there, so be careful. Um, that's never a good sound. Yeah. <coughs> oh, what the pigs are immune! Come on. Obviously dodged it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it ran over him. Yes. Just remember, he's there, and there's the boulder, which you can then use Bye. <coughs> to get some safety. Or you can get up there as well. And the fossil holder. <sighs> and there's the fossil, just decently out of reach, but you're still on the thing. So maybe you can jump, and jump, and jump. What kind of fuzzle are you? I won't know! Jump and press B. There you go, it's glide. Just remember, hogs are anywhere. And they're fast. This does not solve the problem of the bridge, however, <laughs> unless I go left. That still does not solve the problem of the bridge. Dick! What is that? That still does not solve the problem of the bridge. After only one death, he's managed to figure out what to do. <laughs> After only one death. <laughs> Fucking torpedo hogs, Jesus. Interesting to see a Taz run of this, actually. A Taz run? Yeah, the tallest, a tallest assisted speed run. Basically, they can be engineered so every button press is, you know, perfect, and that absolutely zero percent time is wasted because it's literally hard coded in the emulation of when to press buttons. <laughs> and just see a complete run through of this glitchless. Okay, 
careful. Okay, now gently does it. There you go. <sighs> and checkpoint. Yay! Well, fuck. <laughs> you went out of glide path? Yeah. Boulder coming. Boulder to save your ass. <laughs> okay. Yes. Okay. It's going to be useful for something. And spiky death. But you can't push things into the spiky death. You're going to want the glide power there. Yeah. It's fine. We go back to the checkpoint. So we'll try again. Rah. Jump, 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 DDR. Not quite how it goes. Boulder, 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 boulder! Boulder says squish. Now, go fetch boulder. <laughs> and now you are safe. <laughs> <laughs> Ish, maybe. Physics! What you're looking for is a fuzzle. Yes. It's fuzzy wuzzle. There we go. Plummet to your death! Or not. Plummet to your death! Or not. Plummet to my death. Oh, that was silly. No, there's a ladder here. So, you are glide power? Well, considering Maybe. that's what you need... I would say it's a safe bet. That's probably going to be glide. Could be fucking anything the way this game it <coughs> goes. Well, aren't you glad it's glide? Eee. Yeah. Maybe not go that far though. No. <laughs> if you have full knowledge of this, you'll be fine. That's awesome. When the you play this for the second time. Boulder, 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 squish. And back we go. And fetch! Fetch the boulder! There's a good echo. Well done. Hey, we're playing that game we did when Nim was alive. Oh. Oh, too soon. Too soon, dude, too soon. I'm sorry, I'm playing the character I've not wanted to be playing because I've wanted to be playing Nim. Because Nim was all cool looking. <laughs> and Echo is. short. <laughs> well, that's just shortest. It's like, hey, do you want to play as Sonic or do you want to play as Tails? Hang Tails, on, you think? can fly. It's basically easy mode. <laughs> <laughs> nice. What a silly question. Right, so. Bullshit! Bull fucking shit! And the fucking fireflies! How the fuck are you supposed to navigate that with one run? Carefully. No, no, there is no carefully. You are fucked. Th this is fucking flashback. Hey, have fun with this blind jump. What do you mean, blind jump? You know, blind jump. You're not going to be able to see what the fuck's down there. I don't have the teleporter yet. No, you don't. I don't know if it will kill me. No, you don't. Have fun finding out, though. <laughs> With many deaths. Right. Let us push you to your doom again. You're not really pushing it to its doom, though, are you? have been pushing it to its bed. I mean, yeah, I've been pushing it to its fucking sun lamp. Fuzzy Wuzzy got a tan. <laughs> it's like do 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 and sun lamp. But it's not working. There we go. It might be. The light just might be funny. So. Left and then right. Yeah. And I just go carefully. There you go. Fuck that firefly. Right. Look, it's 
the end of that bit of the game. <sighs> chapter six. <laughs> that was indeed the end of chapter six. Deadwood. Deadwood. Ah, oh, you only missed two firefighters in that whole level, in the whole chapter. Oh, yeah, the ones which were assholes to get. <laughs> uh, so that was chapter six. That was, uh, yeah. That was really frustrating. <laughs> no, you see, when I played it, it wasn't oh. frustrating for me. It was tense and a bit worrisome. And yeah, a, but uh, you, you played and enjoyed Sonic 1. Yeah, I did enjoy Sonic And one. Sonic 2. I loved Sonic 2. And Sonic 3. Sonic 2. No, Sonic 3 was... Yeah. <laughs> Sonic 2 was definitely the best Sonic. But yes, that was at Chapter 6. And so next time we'll do Chapter 7. Only two to go, guys. And there's only two acts in Chapter 7. Yeah, so yeah. We, we may have a, a interesting editing for the last few episodes. But yes, yeah. this is Tiger Tales Gaming. My name is Xavier Wolf. And I'm TK. And you've been watching us play Tanglewood. If you want to see more, please subscribe to the channel and see more. And if you want to buy Tanglewood, then it's available for sale at tanglewoodgame.com if you want your very own Mega Drive cartridge. <laughs> Or you can get it on Steam or itch.io if you want to get the digital copy, which comes with a Mega Drive ROM for your emulator or flash card. Hashtag we are not sponsored. No. <laughs> Hashtag also, we hate for this game to be possible. So. <laughs> also, if you want to find out more about us, you can find it out at tigertalesradio.co.uk, tigertales.co.uk, and tigertalesgaming.co.uk. Lots of websites. Lots of websites. We do also have a radio show, which is on Monday nights between 8 and 10. That's the Tiger Tales Radio. Yep. And we play Jackbox variety games at nine. around about 9 o'clock-ish, so feel Give free to take. join. Yep. But Hello yes, we will see you. When... It's a goodbye from the Xavier. Bye-bye. And it's a goodbye from myself, TK. Bye-bye. And next time, we'll be tackling chapter two seven. Left. Two chapters left. Two chapters left, just two. Two little tiny chapters. And I'm then... mainlining coffee. And then he's done. And he or not, you're on Pepsi Max. <laughs> but he's lying to us. He's lying to everybody. <laughs> but until then, it's bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.